Diabetic kidney disease may progress more quickly in smokers than in non-smokers, according to UAB research published in the Journal of Renal Physiology. We know that smoking is an important risk factor in the progression of CKD in diabetics and in non-diabetics. You know, with this study, what we know now is that nicotine, that is one of the main compounds in smoke, it has a major effect in the progression of kidney disease in diabetics. UEB nephrologist Edgar Jamies and his research team exposed diabetic mice to nicotine and compared their kidney function to diabetic mice that were not exposed to nicotine. The results were clear. What we found is that those exposed to nicotine had more fibrosis, which means scarring, and also they had more proteinuria, uh, that is the amount of protein present in the urine, and which is also a marker of a kidney disease. Dr. Jamies said the findings are of concern both for diabetics who smoke and for those trying to kick the habit. In humans, nicotine is used as a means for smoking cessation and uh, that strategy is designed to be used just for a few weeks but if you stay on nicotine for a very long time, in theory there is a possibility that could be deleterious for kidney function.